live and I'm sick but I'm here because I would like to welcome you guys to day one of vlogmas vlog every day until Christmas so every day I'm going to be posting a new vlog a new video a new something Jesus I don't know I think I'm playing myself but I think we can do this we're gonna do this together why am I doing this because I would like to achieve 80,000 subscribers by 2018 and I think that we can do this so without further ado welcome to day one of vlogmas I live in Brooklyn New York and in Brooklyn there's this thing called Flatbush. It basically cuts Brooklyn in half. It runs from the very, very top of Brooklyn all the way to the very bottom of Brooklyn. And if you need to get anywhere in Brooklyn, you can pretty much take Flatbush. And I live ponds the Flatbush. Now on Flatbush, there's this thing called Dollar Vans. They basically look like the Magic School Bus, but with flavor in it, a little more Grace hot sauce, a little split it in the middle, a little Grace seasoning inside of that. And it's run by all of your friendly Caribbean West Indian men. Haitian, Jamaican, the Grenadian, Asian, Trinidadians, basically any West Indian, drives the van. Now the inside of these vans are usually pretty tricked out. Don't make the $2 fool you, okay? We be hooking it up. We got TVs, we got LCD lights, sometimes it glows in the dark, movies be playing in there. We always have the music pumping. The music is always louder than the driver or its passengers, and that's perfectly okay. We have all of that fun stuff, only costing $2. Sounds popping, right? It sounds good. Sounds like a good idea, right? Right? Not today. One day, I'm on my way to the gym before I gotta go to work because I'm trying to get it right and get it tight. I call the dollar van. They come, you get inside, you sit down, and I'm just like looking at my surroundings, just looking at what we're working with today. You know, do I have a TV? Do, what's, what's going on? So let me tell you guys about these red flags. There was at least three, okay? And I, I avoided all of them. Red flag number one, there was a baby seat inside of the passenger seat without a baby inside of the seat. And these are not things that you see usually in a dollar van. Red flag number two, the van basically smelled like the ganja with a little hint of Febreze. Red flag number Number three, and the one that I most definitely shouldn't have ignored, Homeboy was like this the whole time, okay? We came in through the back, he, he didn't move. He didn't check to see what was happening. He just kept looking forward, but we were at a stoplight though, so I don't understand. Light turns green, van started driving, I get on my phone, and all of a sudden I hear a little <coughs> Now, this is not alarming. We hear these noises behind all the vans all the time. Either going too fast or they cut somebody off. But then I noticed that this driver, you know, that was just chilling, Starts going a little, a little faster, but you know, it's fine. It's fine. I got places to go anyway. It's fine. But then he goes a little faster. And all of a sudden he just, this guy made the sharpest of turns, sharper than cheddar cheese. And I'm like, you know what? It's fine. He's cutting traffic. He's cut, he better be cutting traffic. And we're now on like some street that's like not Flatbush, but next to Flatbush. So I'm like, you know what? It's fine. It's fine. We're fine. We, we are fine. And then all of a sudden we hear. <laughs> And then this dude lost his mind. He starts swerving, he starts ducking, he's cutting cars, he's going through intersections, driving through red lights, he's going on islands, and I'm like, the Lord is my shepherd, I shall not want. And in that moment, I realized this dude is on the run. And I'm in the car with him. So many thoughts are going through my mind. Does this make me a criminal? If we get stopped by the cops, does that mean that I get arrested? So we swerving left and right, falling out of our seats. He's driving up one way street. So we all like, let us out. You wildin'. Oh my God, let us out. And he's like, yeah, yeah, yeah. Homie never looked back. He just kept going. <laughs> I'm looking out the window. None of these streets look familiar. This dude is still swerving and he swerves and swerves and then we get down this really thin block and he double parks sideways. And I was like, we park it? The cops pull up behind us like two seconds later. Homeboy rips off his seatbelt, opens this front door and books it. Oh God. Yo. get out their car they come to us they see that we're locked they pry open the doors and they kind of like just do a quick interview with us to ask us what happened and we just tell him that we got into the van and he just started wilding in the end me and that group of people that was on the dollar van we walked together back to flatbush they got on a bus but you know what i did i got right back on the dollar van look i had somewhere to go now i'm really late so 
I really hope that you guys enjoyed this first episode of Vlogmas. We are going to reach 80,000 by 2018. So tag a friend, bring some friends along, subscribe, and share this video, and give it a big thumbs up. Comment down below if you had any type of similar experience. I would love to hear it. And also, comment down below all of your Vlogmas video ideas. I am taking requests because your girl is struggling. I don't know how I'm going to do this, but we're going to do this. We're going to progress. Amen? So thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you tomorrow for another episode of Vlogmas. And until then, never forget to live in love with you.